Hi, I'm Tim Rubble and welcome to another episode of Adventure Athlete. Today I'm working on the next level of my parts. Uh, on yesterday's video, I did a couple uh, cutouts of these uh, hex patterns. That turned out super nice and I'm happy with, with that process. So I wanna make the, the new ones cooler. So I programmed this in the machine in about three or four minutes and getting ready to cut it out with the Everlast 82i and the Archroid CNC Plasma, and then I built this custom water table. And absolutely love this machine and love how the combination of these two machines uh, work really well in conjunction with each other. So we'll hit this on run, and let's see what we get. about a water table is it's uh, cool to the touch. It's a little warm, but nothing that you have to go run and get a glove on. And that just came right off, and I think that looks great. And I'll uh, grind some of that dross off, and I think we'll have a wonderful looking part that uh, is kind of the next evolution. So my thought process on all of this is pretty simple. Like that allows me to lay out uh, letters, uh, numbers, and a lot of different things um, that you just do a simple trace. So like if you wanted it to do race of kings right here, um, now that I can uh, figure out how to do that, I can trace that and make that something that actually works on a cutout. So that's kind of my next evolution. I didn't really think about that when I bought this machine. I used to go run inside to the computer, spend 45 minutes to an hour uh, scanning the tab, building my stuff on that tab. Um, now I come out here, it's three or four minutes. Um, you know, I had a bandsaw at one point in time also, so I would cut out stuff on the bandsaw. You know, if it's just one or two tabs, it wasn't worth going and programming. But now, like this next level stuff is kind of cool that you're able to um, cardboard template to a custom part in like less than, I'm gonna say I probably have five or six minutes uh, invested in getting the camera filming and everything and that's what I basically drew and you can see that overlay on that that just worked out absolutely perfect and it's a game changer it really is for the home shop it's affordable um, I'm not sponsored by Everlast or Arctroid and uh, I think this is just such a cool setup that's going to be it for now questions comments uh, what's your thoughts on this next evolution that I just discovered I'm sure there's been guys out there doing really cool stuff I've seen guys do the um, grind hard plumbing, for instance. Um, he programs all his stuff in Fusion and then imports it to the machine. For me, I don't want to take all the time to do that. I just want to come out and make a cool part and go put it together. So I think my next, this thought process now kind of gives me a lot of stoke. And um, when I build the plate bumper for the Humvee, um, it's going to be a game changer for sure. So stay tuned for that. Questions, comments, hit me up down below. Please take the time to leave me a uh, thumbs up or something uh, in the comment section because it helps the algorithm. 
and I'm here to try to bring you guys more educational, creative content. Thank you for watching. I'm Tim Robel, and I'll catch you here next time.